I came first to the United States when I was 15. My parents gave me the option of having a quinceañera party and spend money on that or send me to the States for a summer to learn English. And I decided that it made much more sense to come to the States for a summer than to have a lavish party. Um, and I came to Pennsylvania to a girls' school for summer where I learned some English. And then uh, when I was, uh, when I finished, I was 17 when I finished high school, I was able to get a scholarship to a college in Colorado where I was asked to be the assistant to the Spanish department uh, teachers who knew the language grammatically and knew a lot of the literature but really had not the fluency with it. And it was, this is pre language labs technology, so they wanted somebody that would actually read the lessons and practice the exercises and give a pronunciation model to the students. And that was my first experience on becoming a teacher because uh, as uh, fate would have it, the sweet nun that was supposed to be the uh, professor of the course had a stroke a couple of days before classes began. So they didn't have a replacement and they said, well, let's put the Cuban girl there to just take over the classes for a few days until we get somebody. And then they decided, well, she's doing it so well she can stay. So at 17, I found myself teaching Spanish 101 and Spanish 201.